So here we are, day four of Ash Rex the Journal. As I said in the little title thing that I did, I'm trying to work out a title thing that I can do that'll like change every time we go through a day and stuff. But I'm still, that was my first graphic, it wasn't great. But um, a few announcements before we start. I'm going to have um, guest appearances tomorrow from my friends because I'm seeing them tomorrow and there'll be more videos on my channel about whatever I'm doing with them because it's YouTube related. Woohoo! But um, yeah, so I'll have at least someone. I'm not sure if they're going to be making with me or another friend. And I don't know. Anyway, so let's get started. Ba -ba -da -da! Document a boring event in detail. I was literally just talking to my friends about this. Like, I it says in one of the instructions to bring this book with you everywhere you go. And so I brought it with me when I went to Shakespeare in the Park today, and they were looking at it, and they literally talked about this. So now I have to document a boring event in detail. Okay, Jessa, Dana, what? <laughs> uh, okay, so I have written my documenting a, bo a document of a boring event in detail. So I guess that. A cat walking isn't that boring, but I guess it's like because it's an everyday occurrence to me because I have cats, it's just something like I take for granted, I guess. So I decided to write about that. So here it is. There was no noise as the small furry beast lifted its leg and propelled its body forwards. No sound was made as it repeated this motion for a second, a third, and then a fourth time. Slowly but surely, the cat made its way across the room. As the cat's strides quickened and grew longer, a muffled thumping could be heard, the pitter-patter of delicate paws on golden-brown wooded floors. This cat had no destination, just the need to move quickly through the hall. With a look that could only be described as boredom, the cat sat down, done with its walk. And that's my document of a boring event in detail. I hope you all enjoyed your little story time, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.